Hi folks, it's simply me and this is Miraculous Ladybug. <laughs> Hi folks, it's simply me and this is Miraculous Ladybug Reaction Season 4 and today we are reacting to Optigami! AKA the game that episode. <laughs> Finally, my fucking gosh, Natalie is alive. She's fucking alive, okay? Get She's fucking alive! I'm trying not to be too loud today because it's almost half to 11 p.m. and my mom is trying to sleep so I don't want to disturb her but I hope I can express my excitement in a very believable way regardless. <sighs> what is wrong with my pronunciation lately so yeah we all saw the trailers we all knew the premise i just want to watch this episode and see something good something that will leave me hyped up for the second half of the season because uh chronologically optigami is the middle of this season. My hopes for Gate Night moments aren't too high, I just hope to see something, it doesn't need to be romantic, although it would be very lovely it, it, if it was. But yeah, uh, I think we can start. To be honest, I am also very excited because I just finished sending out my CV and you know, it's getting cruel to me that I am looking for a job, for an actual job. But anyway, focus. Focus. Okay, so we saw the scene. You are very, very way too excited. Cool. I mean, we all saw that scene already, so. Optigam is very cute, and also, like, I love the fact that this is a fucking butterfly, and this. You know. And not. Any butterfly, it resembles an Akuma, and this is it, it looks like an Akuma. So, if it's not hinting at Natalie becoming temporarily Hackmoth, then I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, she would roll if she was Hackmoth for just a day because she's just very responsible, especially for a teenager. It's, mm. You see. It's not useless. You are not useless. Gabriel agrees. The way she looks at him, I mean, come on. Oh. Of course, the biggest troublemaker in the city. <laughs> I love that we get to see a new render of Audrey. Like, you know, the front page of Style Queen. The way she fucking looks at him. I mean, come on! This is love! Okay, I'm being a bit too loud. <laughs> and also this new render of Adrian. I love Alia with the Kwamis. Like, this is the kind we've been waiting for since the beginning if we didn't even know. Oh! I don't know exactly. Well, true, you decide because it was Master's full rule. Oh my goodness, it's so sunny. Oh, I'm so excited to see what is going to happen. I'm so excited, seriously. Oh, don't be too pushy. Hmm. But we can see that Marinette didn't give up on Adrian actually. So, seriously, I feel like either reveal is gonna happen on they are or they are becoming a couple this season or both. Oh, that's cute. They are playing spice. <laughs> oh fucking hell. So the, she just went into the bathroom. Hmm. 
Ja. Oh, don't you think about leaving? Shit. Yeah, so it was so simple. <laughs> I can't believe you fucking did it. <sighs> Poor Alec, he's so terrified. He's being held hostage by... Not Hagmoth, by Shadow Moth. Honestly, I would switch places with him. <laughs> Wait, what did he say to her? Sorry, I was simping for Shadow Moth and just didn't um, pay attention. <laughs> oh. What an insult. Oh, Even Chloe left? Come on. She's fierce. But to be honest, like, my goodness, I feel sorry for Audrey. I didn't expect it. I didn't expect to feel sorry for her in this moment. But I do, because like, it's her job, it's her life, it's something she's passionate about. <laughs> she's so, so like Chloe in Queen Banana, oh my fucking gosh. I just love how people just acknowledge that this is so normal. Yeah, yeah, Shadow Moth, come on, let's just do it. But I bet Gabriel is having fun, uh, just making fun of her. <laughs> Oh, protective Kagami! <laughs> Poor girl. Okay, so like the their plan is to eliminate the holders and wait for Ladybug and Cat Noir. Oh shit! It was a close call. Way too close. Oh yeah. Marinette, you see, you can be like rather relaxed around Adrian. Even if technically you're both in danger right now. Of course. Also with another holder of the miraculous... Okay. By the way, I'm, I am in my pajamas and... Already took my shower and stuff. <laughs> I wanted to tell you this, I don't know why, but anyway, I forgot, so I'm telling you now. Come on, you are strong. <laughs> yeah. Shit. Oh, come on, this is not the right time. Oh. They are such a good couple. Oh. Well, bye bye. Okay. Okay. Productive Luca! And they are both erased. Damn. Yay! Kwamis have a phone! That's really cool. Like, it, it was a brilliant idea. She gave hints. It's not the time. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, he spotted they are being spied on. So oh, she won't. Shit, what is going to happen? You. Oh, so they. Okay, so they don't suspect either of them. Hmm. Wow, you learned their names. <laughs> Fucking fuck. Wait, but he, but he is supposed to transform. Oh my fuck! Holy fucking fuck! Holy fuck! But seriously, Marnan trusts her so much that I learned to cook. But it's, you know, it, it proves to be useful. But oh my gosh, Sentinino! Senti fucking Nino! Shit! He will transform and. So cute. Okay. <laughs> Next time the whole Paris will be in outer space. Oh, I love the animation. Oh shit. Okay, so now, now they will be going after Alia too. Shit. By the way, we have a proof that a senti monster can use a miraculous and transform. Wait, 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 wait. I need to wa watch this little fragment again. But anyway, I just wanted to say, like, if you don't know, I believe Adrian is a senti monster. So, this is another evidence to this theory. Yay! Uh, I don't know why am I dancing or singing. Um, singing. But I am so happy because it's just like, you know, we have a proof that a senti monster can use a miraculous. Okay, let's come back to this episode. Cute. Kalki is cute. Okay, so we'll probably see Kat Noir. Oh shit. <sighs> I love seeing this. I love seeing this type of content. Lady B. I mean, if she is. If that's her name. <sighs> She's so beautiful. Seriously. They did a good job <laughs> with her design. But oh my goodness, it's Senti Carapace! Or rather, Senti Nino transformed into Carapace.
Jesus Christ, it's basically Shadow Moth working with Ladybug, but... Wait... Oh, okay. Seriously, I cannot believe I'm seeing this. But Optigami is still out there. And Santinino. Shit. Cataclysmus, my fuck. <laughs> oh no, he's too late. Oh, she gave her. <laughs> so cute. Wait, but did she, did she, did she did a miraculous ladybug? Or she didn't. So like, is Nino back or not? Or just the glitter disappeared? Wait a fucking moment. She figured it out. Oh shit! Oh shit, you are screwed! She knows Shadow Moth is somewhere. Yeah, she will, you know. Oh shit, Natalie, no! Yeah. Oh fuck. But it was so close. So fucking close. Yes, they are all back. Yeah. But wait, that's all? Or yes! Oh, they are mischievous, but I am so anxious! <laughs> oh my goodness, shit is getting real! Shit is getting fucking real! Fuck! I don't, I don't even know what to say. This episode was incredible. It was awesome. It left me hyped up for the second half of the season. Even though we still have um, episode uh, 5. Uh, Gabriel Aggressed. Episode 10 and episode 12. So it leaves four episodes in the first half of the season to be aired and I can't wait for them but I also can't wait for the second half of the season when they are talking all yeah and everything and stuff just like oh my gosh it's real danger finally 
so far I've been so impressed with season four and I know that like some decisions are very controversial like when it comes to what I uh, what they are doing with the plot I am into this I am into this I just want to say this and yes we didn't get a romantic cave nut but we got some new scenes with them and it's good and it's clear that they are you know they are taking their side job seriously although of, of course I hope for them to get their shit together and be redeemed one day but you know still I am enjoying the story so fucking much so fucking much <laughs> um also like when I was watching this episode, I realized why it was Mayura who created the Optigami and not Shadow Moth. And it's because one Peacock Miraculous Holder, well, probably can create one Senti Monster at the time. While, you know, uh, multiple Senti Monsters can exist in the same time and space, but at least like when it comes to them maybe maybe there's some way around this <laughs> but uh, to our knowledge and to their knowledge as of today one holder can create one senti monster at a time so Mayura created Optigami who like okay Optigami isn't a person really <laughs> but Optigami can be out there and spy on people and stuff while Shadow Moth creates Senti Monsters for the battlefield. So yeah, I just, you know, I love when things make sense, <laughs> especially when it's miraculous. Um, okay, I forgot to point out a few things again and all of them are about the postcard scene. Like, okay, it's post-credit, but it's not really post-credit, it's post the end card scene. Anyway, the one with Natalie and Gabriel. So first of all, like I, I watched it again and I like love I just love I just love Natalie's like um, gestures and subtle movements and everything. And second of all her room is so spacious and she has chess like, you can't tell me her and Gabriel aren't playing chess all the time, okay? <laughs> and he feels so comfortable sitting on her bed that I just, like, I just can't. I just fucking can't. They are so close emotionally. You can't convince me otherwise. And... You know, the way they were smoked together. I think it was very clear from my reaction that I loved it. I loved the moment. But I just want to say it. To be clear. I so fucking love this moment. <laughs> oh. Okay, okay. Back to the video. But yeah, it will be all for today. I am so happy I could wait I could wait I could well I had to wait but I'm so happy I could watch this episode so quickly and um, I haven't finished editing reaction to Soul Crusher yet but I am almost done so all three reactions will be out there soon I mean okay this is the last one you are going to see so I don't know I even making this announcement but anyway it will be all for today i hope you enjoyed this reaction video i certainly did enjoy this episode and can't wait for another one although i am happy we are getting at least a short break because i <laughs> need it very much well uh is there like anything else i am supposed to say I, I i think like i should say you know check out my social media and stuff but i think like at this point it's kind of obvious that there are some like in the description if you want to see if you don't then it's completely fine so um, but it's just me and my weird perception of the world anyway. Bye folks!